clients talk to, to you about how Steffi used to work in practice or anything like that? Can you speak to it? Yeah, we, we spoke a lot and obviously, you know, we had lots of time in our hands and we, we talk a lot about you know, just approach uh, to practice approach to the match, and um, he, he has so much experience working with Steffi, and um, she was also, you know, emotional player like I was, and he just tried to, you know, to, to, to talk to me, you know, how she kind of um, also was nervous for her matches, and, and that's normal, everyone goes through that, but, you know, it's, it's hard, I still, you know, see her as a champion, and, you know, she can't lose, <laughs> so it's very hard <laughs> to imagine that. So did you take any vacation after Wimbledon, or did you say, no, I haven't really played enough matches and I just need to work now? You no, know, actually, after Wimbledon, I went straight to the gym very next day, and, and I didn't have any time off, because I think I just that's what I needed, and I felt like I needed that, and i just been working pretty much every day since then, and it feels good, it kind of gives me a little bit of confidence, and, and, and you know, feeling good about myself, that, you know, I put everything in place, and I know I, I put my 100%, and then whatever happens. So and I, considering where you've been, I mean, obviously, you, you're not focusing on the ranking, enjoying and, and improving your game, but you ever look at the ranking and sort of like, is that really my name next to that number? No, is I it, don't, but no. when, when I'm like, I need to walk up for the tournament, I'm like, how low is my ranking? <laughs> <laughs> so that's, that's a little bit the hard part, you know, and, and just, you know, thinking, you know, I have to play qualities and, and, and it's, it's, you know, it's, it's hard and, and I think, you know, even though my ranking is now maybe quite low, I feel I'm playing better than my ranking is. So I just I just have to go out there and prove there is no other way around it. And and also I mean I've been thinking of you know other players who went through that and Andre going back to playing twenty tries and so on. So I think many players go through that and just you, you have to stay tough and don't feel sorry for for yourself. And that's what I've done a little bit. And that just puts you back down even more. Some of your